guys, welcome back to my channel. I asked on Twitter quite a while ago if you wanted to see another wedding decor haul or and or a bridal shower haul and you guys voted, 50% voted that they wanted a bridal shower haul so I'm coming at you with that today. My wedding was over a week ago at this point. The stuff has been sitting in my bedroom waiting for me to film this video for way too long. I'm so sorry. Some of the things did get put away. I'm really sorry if you gifted me something and I don't mention it here. I must be using it or I've put it away somewhere because it's been so long. I'm disorganized is basically the problem. The purpose of this video is obviously not to brag, but to give you ideas for if you are hosting a bridal shower or attending a bridal shower or maybe you are about to get married and the bridal shower is for you. Some gift ideas and recommendations. These are things people bought me and I just want to share these ideas with you guys. Welcome to my channel where I have the longest introductions ever. Behind me is full. You can't even see them because they're too low. You can see this one here. I have a lot of stuff to chat about so I'm going to jump right in. I didn't keep the gifts together so if you're watching this and you gave me something I am sorry but I didn't keep everything together like I was supposed to. I did also get a few bottles of wine which most of them I've drank already <laughs> so I can't really show those to you either. Wow I suck. I'm going to start off with, this was a great idea for like the prizes. So I won one game, which I feel like I probably should have won more since it was my bridal shower and I should have known all of the answers to things, but I didn't. But I did win the one of who knew the groom the best. So I guess that's a good thing since I'm the one marrying him or have married him now at this point. And this is the prize that I got for having the most correct answers. So all this came in a little bag. We had this little oven mitt or thing to set hot pots on. I'm not really sure what this is called. We had cupcake cases and these ones are super cute. A small little Betty Crocker spatula as well as some muffin mix and all this came together in a little bag and I just thought this is a really cute idea. This is a super simple thing to do. It says simply add water and obviously these all go together and I just thought that was a really great idea. I don't even know where to go from here. Okay I also got some tea. This is from David's Tea and this is organic cream of Earl Grey. Rich, creamy, and classic. Earl Grey is a tea that I do enjoy, especially in the evenings. Even though it is a black tea and will contain caffeine, it says high caffeine levels actually here. I just find the taste to be very like cozy. I don't know. I'm excited to use this. And what went along with that as well are these cute little deer wine glass markers slash tea bag holders so you can set these on either your wine glass to mark whose is whose or to hold the tea bag up out of your tea and I think these are adorable and I believe I'm sorry if I'm wrong <laughs> that these mugs came with this gift I should have just kept everything in the bags I'm with the worst youtuber slash in-law ever these are from Stokes. They are a mug set, New Bone China, and they just have positive um, sayings, I guess, on them. So one says, oh, you can't even see them. Every day of sparkling, amazing things will happen. Think happy, be happy, and make your dreams happen. I think these are just adorable. If you are thinking of picking these up, do keep in mind that these are not dishwasher or microwave safe. Um, but they're super cute so who cares. I got a lot of kitchen things which I don't really have spaces to put them so I guess that means it's forcing me to do that kitchen declutter that I've been promising you guys forever and ever but I think they're just calling me out on that. I got these adorable um, girlfriends cups from Luminark. Luminark, yes. 
I will of course try and find as many of these things online as possible to link them down below for you. These are just four cute little glasses with different colored lipstick marks on them. And these are dishwasher safe if that is something that is of concern to you. Okay, Jeremy's grandmother got me this and it's very heavy. Ugh. These are by Anchor Hawking. Oh my god, I'm so weak. Ooh, and it is a huge box of, these better be glass or I'm gonna feel really weak. Yes, glass kitchen storage set and snug fitting lids. They are freezer, okay, they're microwave, oven, freezer, and dishwasher safe. And there are 24 pieces and I need to set it down <sighs> because I'm a big weakling. Dish, Tupperware type of sets are always a great thing for gifts, especially as a mom, I'm doing lunches, leftovers, all of that. And the fact that these are freezer, microwave, dishwasher, blah, 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 safe, makes them really versatile and I'm really happy to have those. And isn't there a saying that your socks that you lose in the dryer come back as Tupperware lids that don't have a bottom? Because I definitely have that problem. I'm in such a weird mood today if you couldn't already tell i'm sorry next i got these adorable wine glasses they're like the wine glasses of the stems which is perfect for me because i somehow always manage to break the stem and then my wine glasses are basically useless so i got these ones and this says don't ask just pour it's okay to whine a little wine because adulting is hard and liquid therapy i can't wait to wash these up and use them and these are not dishwasher safe a lot of things with these cute um lettering on them are not dishwasher safe because the heat and the uh, amount of pressure the water squirts around in there uh, will peel all that stuff off Jeremy's parents got me this adorable um, picture frame and we are going to get it engraved and I said oh thank you my new husband is so cute don't you think obviously that is just the stock photo I was just being ridiculous um, this is going to look great I'm gonna have a hard time choosing what wedding photo I want to put in here though I got another picture frame here. This one has a more like weathered look to it, which really matches my home decor style, even though my house isn't even decorated properly. But in my ideal world, this is going to match really great with the rest of my imaginary decor. And the last thing I have here to share with you are these bath bombs. My mom got me these. These are the Secret Jewels bath bombs. There's rose, jasmine, water lily, freesia, and mango orange. And in one of these, there is a special piece of jewelry, but you don't know which one. Um, leading up to the wedding is obviously a very stressful time in a bride-to-be's life. Wow, was it ever horrible, but like exciting at the same time. And bath bombs are obviously a great way to relax. My bathtub is currently filled with all of the things I still haven't unpacked, even though we moved in here at the end of March. But thanks, Mom. I will use these eventually. And this is a great gift idea if you are attending a bridal shower. Okay, I know I talked through that really fast. I'm fighting against nap time and I had two videos to film so I talked really fast through both of them. I'm sorry. I hope you got some great ideas for bridal shower gifts if you are, like I said, attending or planning whatever a bridal shower. Thank you so much to everyone that came to my bridal shower and gifted me these lovely things. And for those of you on Twitter who congratulated me on my marriage, I love that I'm making friends finally on this platform. I feel like I've just been uploading videos and not talking to anybody, but the last few months I feel like I'm finally making some friends on this space and I just appreciate it so much, especially with the last week and a half that I've had. I am not going to cry. I just appreciate I just appreciate you guys so much. 
If you enjoyed today's video, please do give me a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you in my next one. Bye!